Greetings, Imperial Brothers, and welcome back. Okay, so we are ready to go. Our attributes are restored. We're looking good. I equipped um, a Daedric Katana, so if we get into a nasty situation and the uh, Chode's Axe doesn't cut it, we can um, whip out the Katana in a sticky situation. Um, Dan... Asher Dan. <laughs> Asher Dan. Okay. The modern sounding names really um, ruin the immersion for me. May I help you, Outlander? I think you can, man. So, you're a young man. Yes, 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 yes. I, uh... Exquisite shoes. Oh, God. Yes, they're quite splendid, aren't they? Oh, man. I, uh, I don't want to think about that anymore. Okay, we killed your vampire, man. We killed him. How do I tell you we killed him? We killed him. Yeah, Calvario, that was his name. Dead. Well then, perhaps I was mistaken. Perhaps you should be the every. That was fairly easy. It's, it's so, all these tasks, the funny thing is, I feel like a lot of different people in this world could pull off the stuff that we're doing. But, um, everyone's, like, so surprised. Well, so you killed the vampire Calvario. Uh-huh. Um, well, I will be happy to acknowledge you as Zainab Nevrine. Heck yeah. But, okay. Big butt here. Holy shit. But it is customary for one seeking an honor from the Ashcan to offer the Ashcan a generous gift as a mark of... No, no more exquisite shoes. We're over that. I bypassed that, okay? Because you are an outlander and do not know our customs, I will do you the great favor of naming the gift I wish to receive. Oh, shit. A highborn Telvanni bride. A pretty one. Plump with big hips to bring me many sons. It seems kind of messed up. Do I want to bring you a bride? I don't know. I don't think so. Where will you find a highborn Telvanni bride? That is simple. You should visit highborn Telvanni lords. Makes sense. And inform them that the Ashkan Kashad of the lordly Zainab would do them the honor of making their daughter his bride. Surely many Telvanni lords would be honored to receive such an offer. Consider carefully the many daughters offered and choose for me the finest. He wants a thick one. Take counsel with my wise woman, Sonumu. Zabamat. She knows my mind well. This is... What, do you guys have a sexual relationship? You and the wise woman? Okay. This is, uh... Very interesting. I wonder what the wise woman's gonna say. Go ahead, Outlander. What Why? Do you need? Who? Who's doing battle with me right now? Are you serious? Why is there always this one beetle? Poor guy. All right, wise woman. You pretty much told me, plump, hippie. Um. Bride, 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 bride. He's a clever Ashcan and a very great man. Is he really? He is not a modest man. He is very proud and conscious of his rights and honors. It is fortunate for our tribe that he heeds the counsels of his modest and loyal wise woman. That's good. Kashad wants a Telvanni bride, eh? No, Highborn Telvanni would wed an Ashlander, but I have a plan. Go to my friend Seville. Slave mistress of the festival slave market. That's really messed up. And tell Arun. And tell her you need a pretty Dunmer slave to pose as a Telvanni lady. Holy shit. She had this already all thought out. She was just ready for this to happen. Then Seville will tell you what clothes to buy. Oh my god. We're buying more clothes. We're still clothes shopping. I can't believe this. And we'll dress her like a hell highborn Telvanni. Then escort the pretty slave to Zainab camp. And present her to Ashkan Kashad as a highborn Telvanni bride. He won't know the difference. This. Okay. Um. All right. Off to tell Arun. This is. This is bizarre. Oh my God. Not another moaning seductress thing. What would you call this? It's not, it's not like a succubus. It's just a messed up chick. Oh 
Winged Twilight. Everything sounds like a metal band to me. I don't know why. All right, here we are. Man, it's, it's storming. I don't know where the... Uh... Oh, here she is. Welcome, young man, to the Festival Slave Market, the finest slaves in Vardenfell. I'm Seville, and I know we have the slave for you. Are you looking for standard household slaves? Something special, I think. You need to slave to pose as a highborn Sylvani lady? Sweet. <laughs> oh, sweet Alma. I thought she was remarking. That Sonumu Zabomat and her cunning plans. I do have the slave you want. Falura Lerva. A pretty Dunmer girl. But first you must get an exquisite shirt, an exquisite skirt, and exquisite shoes. I'm going to lose it. To dress her in. Go get these exquisite clothes and bring them to me and then we will discuss a price for her. I'm at a loss for words. I can't believe we're back at square one. And we've actually lost ground. Because before, all we needed was the shoes. But now, we need the whole exquisite outfit. Is there a clothier here? All right. Elegant here in Telmora is a clothier. Her name is Elegant, like elegant. She looks very elegant. She's got a grandiose outfit on. Expensive, expensive, exquisite. Okay. Um, exquisite shoes. No exquisite shoes. Okay, but we got the... Uh, exquisite... Oh, exquisite shoes. Hell yeah. Exquisite skirt. Um, what else did we need? We need an exquisite shirt, exquisite skirt, and exquisite shoes. All right, I need to get the shirt. Oh my god, if only I had gone to her in the beginning. Sorry, stranger. My time is short, so get on with it. Jesus. Okay. Shirt, skirt, shoes. Okay, let me... I just gotta be real careful that I have all this. Skirt, shoes, shirt. We did it! The toughest part of the game! The difficult part of the game! Oh. I don't even notice these guys before. Man, that's... So sad. Jesus. Well... To be honest, it looks like you can just walk right out of there whenever you want. Those aren't too... Bars aren't too skinny or anything. Alright. What is she... <laughs> yes, we've spoken before. I got your clothes. No, 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 no. No, I got them. Yes. That's actually exactly who I went to. Yes. Um. Oh, okay. Something special. Good. These clothes are perfect. Hold on to them. You'll give them to her when you've bought her. How much is she going to be? This is so messed up. But I need a little more time to coach her to play the part of a highborn lady. I know just the thing we need. Go get a bottle of Tilvani. Okay, I have one. Well, I have Tilvani bug must. Is the perfume different? It's the same thing, right? Yes, I do. Okay, good. I'll bypass that immediately. Finally. We have the leg up on something. I feel like everything's been a losing battle. You have the Telvani Bag Musk? Excellent. No, don't give it to me. You'll give it to her when you have bought her. Now, let me tell you my price. For this superb specimen, skillfully coached to play her part in your little scheme, I am pleased to accept from you the modest sum of 1,200 drakes. Okay. And I only offer you this special prize out of my friendship. Yeah, yeah, right, right, right. Yeah. Very good. Thank you for your custom, and come back soon. Now, here's the key to her cage. Jesus. I've removed her slave bracers. When you're ready, you should speak to Falura. Give her the presents, the exquisite clothes, and the musk. 
and explain to her that she is to follow you back to Zaynab camp. Okay. I'm going to have to really protect her, won't I? Is this her? Jesus. Hello. God. This makes you feel so bad. Um, hello. Yes, Sarah. Daughter of Androna, Lord of Tel Lervu. Pleased to make your acquaintance. See, Seville has taught me well. I shall be a highborn Telvani lady, and no one will know the difference, just like a lady. I admit I am a little anxious about marrying an Ashlander, even an Ashlander chief, but anything is better than being a slave, and I am very tough and smart and determined to make the best of my chances. But Seville said you wanted to give me something. I am yours. Jesus. Now I cannot wait to meet the bridegroom. God, this is messed up. Here you go. Oh, Sarah, these clothes, they are divine. Such a perfume. Only the very rich can afford this. I shall do everything I can to please you and my new master. That is, my gracious lord and husband-to-be. Come! I am so excited. I cannot wait. Let us travel together. Is she really, though? Or is she just like... I'm listening. Go ahead. This feels so wrong, guys. I feel bad. Um, okay. Here comes the real trick is getting her to the camp. This is gonna be, um, yeah. This is gonna be quite something. Come here, bitch. <laughs> bitch, I know, I felt bad for her and I'm immediately just annoyed. Are you ready now for me to come? Yes, yes, let's go. Let's travel together. Goodbye. Makes a lot of sense. Okay. Oh, this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be really fun. I can tell already. All right. Yes. Come on. Okay. It's uh, it's really not that bad. It could be a lot worse. Kind of a straight shot. I'm only worried about the water. We do have a lot of water to cover. This is so sad. I'm dragging this slave through the rain to wet her to this tribesman. It's, I'm sure her exquisite clothes are soaking. Yes, 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 yes. No, 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 no. Get off. Jesus. Oh, come on. <laughs> All right. Can you... All right, so far so good. Once we get to the, m oh no, oh no, <laughs> oh no! I think it's all been ruined. Yeah. Okay. Whew. I'm so glad she got out of that. Where the? F How do you get up here? Why does everything have to be so steep? Can we just? All right, this is looking better. Oh boy, I'm so scared right now. Where are you? Where are you? Yo, where are you? Seriously. Where Where the what are you doing? Come on. Oh, God. What? Where? Oh, I thought I heard battle music. God, I'm just I'm just ready for it now. I have PTSD from the water. Um okay. Hello. Where'd you go? Yo, where, where is she? God damn it! This is maybe this won't be so easy. Where? What? Where? If she dies, please God, where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Where is 
God damn it. All right, you good? Get up. Get out of the water, you weirdo. Come on. Thank God. Okay. Yes, yes. Okay. Okay, we're almost to the mainland. Not much longer now. Everything will be okay. It'll be cliff races from here on out. Nothing we can't handle. There, it's right there. Yeah. Easy peasy. Let's go. Yes. Okay, cool. All right. You're doing great. Keep it up. What? God! He's got a lot of spunk for a slave. Alright. Here we are. Um, yeah. Okay. Come along! Koshan is going to be delighted to see you, I'm sure. Alright. The wedding awaits. Yes, yes, Sarah. Yes, we are here safely. And this is this fine man. He is to be my bridegroom? Yes. He is very distinguished looking, isn't he? A bit severe, perhaps. But the lines on his face there show that he likes to smile. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Sarah. I think I will be very happy. Okay, that's uh, how nice. There you are. Walk with virtue. This is her new life now. She paces back and forth in the yurt. Um, yeah, this is <laughs> this is what her existence has become. What I guess it's better than want? hanging out in that cage. Yo, so you are young. Yes, what the hell? We don't have to reacquaint ourselves every time we talk. I got you a chick. Here she is. Here's your chick. Nervine. Yeah, yeah, you have her. She's right here, dog. What are you, blind? Telvani Bride. This is my new bride. I am very pleased with your gift, young man. Though she is not so generous in the hips as I would like. Goddamn, dude. I promise to make her a happy bride and to do her honor as a highborn Telvani lady. And, as I have said, I will now name you Zainab Nerevreen. War leader of the Zainab and protector of the people. I must also give you the Zainab thong. Thanks. An enchanted heirloom of the tribe, which shall be a sign of all Dunmer that the Zainab have named you Nerevarine. Awesome, man. Thank you. Thong of the Zainab. I can't wait to try this on. I'm sure he'd like to see the thong of the Zainab on his bride. Wait, what does it actually look like? Is that it? <laughs> Wait, no, wait, no, what is it? Nothing happened. All right, young man is going commando. What does it do? That's, that's, that's the more important thing. Detect animal, 150 feet. Okay, why not? It doesn't look like it conflicts with anything we were wearing otherwise. So might as well just put on the, oh, that's a weird look. Just the greaves. I didn't realize how short they stopped. They're like, like jorts. I'm glad that's over with. I'm not buying any more clothes for anyone ever again. And yes, you enjoy your... Get out of my way! Your new life of walking into the basket. Alright. <laughs> what a happy ending. Not really. I feel like she's... It's almost creepier when the slaves are, like, apparently okay with it. You know? When they just go along with everything. It's chilling, and it's tragic. Okay, we are much further south now in the Molag Amur region. And we're headed to the Arabanimsun camp. We're right outside of it, it looks like. This area, even though it's so far removed, it reminds me a lot more of the Urshalaku region. Because it's, I guess it's closer to the volcano and it gets all rocky. 
Is this it? Oh. Well, it was there. <laughs> okay, please don't disappear this time. This is it, right? No, please. All right, here we are. In all its glory. Kumu. Is there something you need? No. I need this camp to not disappear. If you can make sure that doesn't happen again. Hello. Ass bent. Okay. Um Let's meet the ash can of this particular yurt. Ahaz. <laughs> okay. You're the outlander who claims to fulfill the Nervine prophecies? Oh, you are the outlander. Yes, I am. I what do you think? Dog. I want to be the Nervine. We know about the prophecies. We think they are foolish superstitions. Don't bother us with this nonsense. Oh, for real? Interesting. What about you? Aha. Uh -huh. Yes, I am. I want to be the Nervine. Oh my god. Nobody cares about that. You just make us tired. What the hell? These people are so depressing. Uh, maybe the wise woman is a little bit wiser than these folks. If I know anything about... Okay, no. Another ass guy. Salato. Where's... Do they not have a wise woman? A dot. What is Here. this about? It's about... Is this the wise woman? Yes. Wow, she's got a nice big camp. Damn. They must really appreciate their wise woman. Hello, Manny Ray. I am Manny Ray, wise woman of the air. Blah, 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 blah. You are the outlander who claims to fulfill the Nervine prophecies. Yes. Nervine prophecies. Yes, I do. Never. Jesus. Not well. Ashken, Ulaf, Paul, and his war loving air blah, 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 live. They all hate outlanders and are proud and haughty. And will never suffer an outlander to rule them. If you would be Nervine of the thingamajig, you must kill Ulaf Paul and his supporters, the Gulakans. Aha. Oh. You must help me make peace loving Erebanumsum or Ashkan. Ashkan, how could then name you? Okay. Okay, easy. Easy peasy. But before anything else can be done, oh shoot. You must first eliminate. Yeah. And you should come speak with me. Okay. Go ahead. Sick. Okay. I think I know exactly what I need. I'm gonna save first, just to be careful. It's when I go around <clears throat> killing people, it gets, uh, you know, kill the wrong guy, or, you know, something goes awry. It can be very bad. Is there okay. something I can do for you? I'm gonna go kill your leader. What do you think about that, dog? All right, there were two more guys, I think. Um, I might as well ready myself. These guys seem like warriors. Probably nothing. Oh, he, he can't even see me right now. <laughs> Probably nothing. Okay, never mind. Maybe they're gonna be really, really easy to kill. Um, let's see. Oh. Die, Fetcher. Wow! Right on cue with each other. Alright. Wow, actually that was, um... Incredibly easy. Sanit kills Heart of Fire. Okay, that's kinda cool sounding. Sounds like a classic novel. For this semester, we will be reading Heart of Fire. I think I'm thinking Heart of Darkness. That's why it sounds like a book to me. Um... I have slain one of the war living or blah, blah, blah. perhaps it would be impossible to have friendly dealings with them or their leaders anyway. Yeah, she told me to do this. Ulaf Paul, Ahaz, Ranabi and Ashu Ahe. Ranabi and Ashu Ahe. Ranabi. <laughs> I'm coming for you, Ranabi. I love this. I love just being able to kill these people. Oh yeah? Alright, sweet. Why not you, Ember Hand, Biter Hand? Eh, they're not really worth that much. Weird. Got anything cool in here? Guess not. All right. What was it? 
Ahu Ahe, Ashu Ahe. Ashu Ahe. This will be your last Ahe, Ashu. Man, he looks dumb. Yes, Outlander. What do you want? <laughs> you in He was all like ready for battle and he just folds like a bug. Mountain spirit. Ooh, nah, I'm okay. I got better shit than that. Okay. Um, what do I do now? I have slain... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I must raise Gulakan Han Amu to Ashkan. I saw him over here, wasn't he over here? Han Amu. Hello, man. Wait, you're not Han Amu. Han Amu. I don't care. I don't want to be Gulakan anyway. You gotta be Gulakan, dog. This isn't your choice. I don't want to be Gulakan. I'm not good at fighting. And no one likes me anyway. It's okay. The people who didn't like you are probably the ones I killed. I can't make anyone do anything. I just want everyone to leave me alone. Alright, what if I give you money? That seems to be the one thing that works around here. This is suitable. Yeah, see? You want to be Gulakan now? Yeah. What if I give you more money? Yeah, my judgment is good because I give you money. You want to be Gulakan now because my judgment is good? Okay, you know what? What do I do for you, man? What do I do with you? Yes, yes it is. Very insightful. Right, I'm going to give you one more... Hundred. You love me as much as you possibly can. Shh. All right. What well, should I go talk to the? Uh, what what do about you? Do you know anything? You'll find no welcome here. I'm afraid. Yeah, I've, I've already kind of figured that out. Thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna go talk to the wise woman again. She's the only one with any sense around here. Makes sense, is she's the wise one. But it's kind of sad that the wise woman is like the only kind of normal person. We may consider the narrowing prophecies and how you may be named. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With those dudes dead, it is simply a matter of naming. Yeah, myself narrowing. But I need to. Yeah, I need to persuade Gulakan to become the Ashcan, seek him out. Of his gulak yurt. Be prepared, however. It's not the material one would choose when looking at that. Okay. Well, he... He is sure difficult to persuade because... He can't possibly like me any more than he does now. 300 bucks and he's just... He's my biggest fan. Um, what Manny Ray says... I don't care what Manny Ray says. I'm a weakling, a coward, a fool. I hate it, but it is true. Uh, want to be Ashkin. Yes, I recognize it. Ranaby wore that robe, the robe of Ur, Ur Dan the Wise. It was handed down to Ranaby through his family. But what has that got to do with me wanting to be Ashkin? Show the robe to make a little speech. Um, no, yeah, I'm giving it to you, son. Take it. Thank you. Your lesson is clear. <laughs> that I killed him? That's the lesson that was clear? Oh, there he's got the robe now. It is the robe that gives wisdom and counsel, and it is the idea of the robe that gives confidence to the tribe. But it is the Ashken who wears the robe. The Ashken who accepts responsibility. Oh, what, he's all wise now because he's wearing the robe? Who holds the fate of the tribe on his hands? This is a sobering lesson. <laughs> I was given thought. Uh... Alright, you're gonna make me nervy now, you little... What? You killed them just because of his prophecy. The, these prophecies? You are mad, I tell you. I am not the Ashkan, and I do want not want. Wait, I thought you were just. I thought you just changed your tune. Here, take the heart of fire, dog. Thank you. Your lesson is clear. It is the amulet which gives courage and valor, and is the idea of the amulet that gives confidence to the tribe. But it is the Ashkan who wears the amulet. Okay, yay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Didn't we just. Holy mother of God. Hello, wise woman. He's, uh... 
You must find some way to give him strength, willpower, and intelligence. What did I take from Ranavi? Maybe I need to take his... I'll take the gloves or something? Maybe the sword? Okay, and then uh, the uh, the curious from the other guy. Ashu Ahe. I feel like I'm going to be over encumbered if I try to take this cure. Okay, we're, no, we're good. Okay, here, just take all the shit <laughs> and just become the dude. Dude, okay, I have this, I have this shit on me. How do I give it to him? This has to be it. It's either the gloves, the sword, or the curious, or all of them. All right, let me go back to the other camps and just double check if I'm missing any token. Wind of a Haas? Is that what you're missing? The axe? God, I'm just carrying a bunch of shit now. Okay. I thought it would make sense if there's like one thing from each guy. But, um... Maybe not? Give the axe. There you go. Thank you. Your lesson is clear. It is the Ashkin who bears the axe. The Ashkin who accepts responsibility. Yes, 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 yes. Very cool, very cool. Oh, that was it. Okay, cool. Now with Olaf Paul dead, I hold the fate of the tribe in my hands, and I must accept that responsibility. Thank you for your lesson. I shall be Ashkin. I just handed him shit, and he's like, ooh, now I understand. And I do not need the axe. You should keep it for yourself. Great, more shit to carry around. Thank you. And if you wish, I shall name you... Yes, that's why I'm here. You know that's why I'm here. Maybe you will be a shitty yurt man, whatever the hell. Name you Nervarine. Thank you, young man. I promise that as Ashkan, I shall do my best to amend the dark reputation of the dudes. And as my first action as chief, I now name you Er Nervarine, champion of the B -b -b and protector of the people. You must also go to the wise woman Manaray and get from her the seizing of the people, an enchanted heirloom of the tribe, which shall be assigned to all Dunmer. The okay, great, 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 great. Yes. Give me my heirloom, dog. I just fixed all your shit. Give it. So, young man, you were called Neverin, and Han is now our Ashcan. Many changes, many changes. Yes, give me my shit. You have persuaded him to accept his responsibilities. Now we will see if he grows in wisdom and becomes a good and wise chief like his father. Give me shit. Give me shit. Yes. Here, take this enchanted token of the air blah, 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 that all may know that we have named you cha uh, Nervereen and Champion. Okay, cool. Uh, the seizing of the Broskis. What is this thing? What is it? The seizing of the... Whatever, I don't really care what it is. What... It was it a book? Like, what is it? Oh, I'm out of... Oh, wow, I'm straight up out. Okay, cool. Um, I kind of want to... It was called the, the, the Seizing. Okay. Uh, oh, Telekinesis. That's kind of cool. And what is it? What kind of... Oh, it's... Uh... Wait, what the hell is it? <laughs> I can't tell what any of these pieces of clothes are. Um... Whatever, that's fine. Okay, so... Yes. Um, all we have left now is the Urshalaku camp. So next time we'll go back there. That'll be our final tribe. And then we will officially be the Nervrian among all the tribes people. Um, as always, thank you to the patrons. Thank you to the subscribers. And to everyone who watches. And we will see you next week. Take care.